So if you are trying to figure out what you want for breakfast, I've got a friend who can help with that. We've got 7th and Grove's Christopher Glenn on the stovetop today. Thanks for being on the show. Thank you for having me. Anytime. What are we cooking? Oh, this morning we're going to have a couple of our chef specials. So this right here, this is our steak and eggs. Ooh. It is absolutely phenomenal. We have our delicious 50-50 hash, which has a little bit of Yukon gold potatoes and our wonderful sweet potatoes mixed in together. Ooh. Some scallions, a little bit of our house seasoning. So it's like a little bit uh, of savory and sweet, kind of. Yeah, it has I a like nice, that. you know, sweet, salty type thing. Then, of course, here we have our steak. This is our Kansas City strip. And Ooh. I love it when it is about a good medium, medium well. Samesies. If you're eating your steak well done, you're not doing your steak justice. You really I'm are not. I'm so sorry. And you have it in a cast iron skillet. Yes. Talk about course. the importance of that, like cooking your, your meats and your proteins in cast iron. Well, honestly, it's, I love it for the flavor. Agreed. It's the flavor that really kind of adds. It has a little, it, it's a little bit of character. You know, that's how you used to cook back in the day. I know. We didn't have these old, you know, fancy gadgets and gadgets. Go grab your grandma's old uh, old uh, cast iron. It's better than anything, anything you could probably else. buy at the store. And she has that old grease that's kind of set in the corners <laughs> That's the seasoning. That's, that's the, the seasoning. whole point. Exactly. All right, so we're going to get started on our eggs now while all this is kind of going. Yeah, so we're just going to do a simple sunny side up egg. Okay. So we're just going to wait for that oil to get a little warm, and then we're going to drop it right in there. It's going to be... Like it, in the meantime, while you're waiting for that, you did have on display that people probably a, a sneak peek of is that oxtail and grits. Yeah, I hear that's a favorite around around these parts. You know, it's something that we have just on special. So you know, if you're trying to figure out what you want to have on a Saturday morning, come down to Seventh and Grove and try that out. Right, the grits are phenomenal. That I can attest to. I've never had the oxtail, so I'm excited uh. to to pick out on that. And then the piece de resistance is your like uh, cornbread, which is amazing. Absolutely I'm just going to eat this piece. Um, and it does. Ha does it have corn chunks in there? I'm not, I can't remember. No, it doesn't have uh, corn in there, but just it does like have it. our um, jalapeno dice. Yeah, so. it gives it a little bit of a, a kick to it. It's not too spicy if you're afraid of spicier food. All right, cool. All Let's right, so we're getting ready get to plate this. That was yes. quick. Yes, that's how we like to do it at the Grove. Mm -hmm. Quick and easy. Boom, boom. Ooh, yeah. Hear that sizzle? Yes. That's baby. good stuff right there. I'm just in here stuffing my face. Sorry, that's why I'm so quiet. Uh, it's good, isn't it? It is really good. I can't help it. I'm sorry. We'll put our steak right on the top of that there. Get a little bit of our in-house steak sauce. Ooh, I dig that. Hit it with a little swirl, a little drizzle, a little razzle-dazzle. And while you get that egg on there, people are saying, like, look, I'm, I don't want to do my own breakfast today or brunch. Where can they find 7th and Grove at? Oh, we can find us right here in Ybor City. It's at uh, 1930 East 7th Avenue. It literally on 7th. Literally on 7th. You can't miss it. Well, thanks, uh, Chris, for coming on the show. We are going to be right back after the break. He's going to finish that off for us.